Are you disabled and unable to work and wondering how to get Social Security disability benefits? My name is Caitlin Wildoner, and I'm an attorney who helps disabled clients obtain their disability benefits as quickly as possible so they can focus on getting better. Today, we're going to talk about how to apply for Social Security disability benefits if you are disabled and unable to work for a period of at least 12 months. Before applying, you'll want to check eligibility requirements. If you meet the eligibility criteria for Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, or Supplemental Security Income, SSI, benefits. This includes having a qualifying disability, and for SSDI, a sufficient work history, and for SSI, meeting certain financial need requirements. After that, you'll want to gather necessary information, including your personal information, medical records, doctor's contact information, work history, and other relevant documents that help to support your claim for disability benefits. You can apply in three ways, online through the Social Security Administration's website, over the phone by calling the Social Security Administration's toll-free number, or by scheduling an appointment at your local Social Security office. Whether applying online, over the phone, or in person, you will need to fill out the application form with accurate and detailed information about your medical condition, work history, and other required data. Submit any medical records, test results, doctor's statements, and other evidence that helps to support your claim for disability benefits. You may also be asked to fill out additional documentation, including supplemental questionnaires, function reports, and you may have a third party complete a third party report where they can explain what they see you go through on a daily basis with respect to your conditions and how they impact your ability to function. If you're applying for SSI benefits, you will also need to provide information about your income, assets, and living arrangements so that the agency can help to determine your financial need. Ensure that you have submitted all relevant documents along with your application or shortly thereafter to avoid delays in processing. After applying, stay in touch and be responsive with the Social Security Administration and the state agency. You can occasionally check the status of your application, but you'll want to be sure that you are providing any additional information in a timely manner as it's requested. The application process can take several months, and so be prepared for the possibility of an initial denial. If denied, you then have the right to appeal within a specific time frame. Remember to be thorough and accurate in your application and consider seeking help from a qualified Social Security Disability Attorney to help navigate the process effectively and potentially improve your chances of a successful disability claim. Thanks so much for watching. If you're disabled and unable to work, click the scheduling link below or give us a call directly for a free consultation where we discuss your case and see what I can do to help you.